Yeah. Red to red, black to black. Mm -hmm. Red to red, black to black. For many people, a trip to the library is a chance to check out a great book. Ta da! Okay, so we're going to do something simple. Right. But for students around the valley, a class held after school at the Burton Farr Central Library offers a whole new kind of learning. Oh, in these classes, you won't find kids with their heads in the books. Why does it keep moving? As part of the Shoots and Wires after school program, they're experimenting hands-on with everyday conductors like Play-Doh and batteries to understand the technology that makes our world work. You feel good about that? <laughs> no? Okay. Librarian and instructor of Shoots and Wires, Terry Ann Lawler, explains the process behind the program. We don't give direct instructions. We give them the general idea and the concept, and we allow them to figure things out on their own. And that gives kids the ability to explore and become innovative and be really proud of what they've just done. Right. There we go. Smoking in there. The students were able to create different everyday devices like a light bulb or a circuit. For seventh grader Luke, it was an awesome chance to explore a favorite subject. I have always really liked science, and this just makes me help me feel like I can be a scientist someday. It was especially enjoyable when it, it annoyed my little brother, who was annoying. Their devices were a little too complicated for me to understand. So wow, Jason, what are you working with there? I'm working with Makey Makey, <laughs> of where you connect these positive and negative wires to send the electrical current through the clay to make these lights light up or to make this motor spin. Mm -hmm. So through these experiments, you can see not only are these students learning about science, technology, engineering, and math, they're actually having a little bit of fun along the way. It's cool that outside of school we could do something fun, but something that teaches you like a lot of life skills. There, there's nothing quite like watching a kid get that aha moment um, and when they get that and they, they're excited about it, there's nothing like watching that. It's very cool. Uh, the jar's getting hot now. Wow, there it went out. That was it. <laughs> the reward from their successful afternoon experiments continued to inspire curiosity in the students. Do look, you see the smoke. <laughs> By allowing them to get a feel for their future field, the Shoots and Wires program offered Valley students a window to exploring the exciting world of technology. For No 99, I'm Katie Beery.